Gatorbyte back here with the Wi-Fi Pineapple Pager. We're looking at firmware version 1.0.4. We're gonna very quickly go through this setup for the firmware. Yes, make sure that you're not blocking any of the holes for the thermal side of the house. Yes, make sure that it's charged USB-C. I've got that going on as well. You can set up a pin code, which I'll do for demo purposes here. If you've not seen the interface before, the default, you can go through and edit, you can go through and set things up. Darren Kitchen has got some videos on how to create your own custom setup and keyboard, which is kind of sweet. So you can go through and set that up. Yes, this is not my permanent pin. This is just going through and setting things up temporarily so you can see what this looks like. And super secure password for demo purposes only. Because this is going to be wiped and redone here as soon as we're done. But that's how you can go through, save things, set the password, set the time zone next, set time zone, UTC4, I'm on West Coast, woot woot. After that, yes, we're going to accept the license. Uh, we're just going to continue to dashboard. Boom, we're good to go. Starting services. Check out my other shorts for how to get up and running with a pineapple pager. Like and subscribe. And we're now on version 1.0.4. Follow for more.